a really super fast video and every time I say that it ends up being six minutes long but um, I went to a Weight Watchers meeting because I just wanted to learn about the new um, program that they have. I'm not so sure that I'm going to do it but it sort of got me thinking again about hidden calories and uh, you know how you basically don't realize what you're taking in every day. Like you just look at the big picture, but you're not really looking at all the little things and how they add up. So I just wanted to send out two really quick tips in case you are in the market to lose a little weight. Um, number one, and I've mentioned this before on my blog, what I do is whenever I start cooking, whenever I cook grilled chicken, I always start off with a tablespoon of olive oil and that's fine. But I never, if it looks like I need to add a little bit more, I actually add black tea. I don't add any extra oil because the oil counts as points, additional points on Weight Watchers, calories, however you want to apply it, fat. Um, but tea is zero everything. So if you need a little extra something to saute, to brown your chicken, believe it or not, black tea works. Uh, I just brew a pot, I keep it in my fridge, and then I go ahead and I use it while I'm cooking. It works. I've, I've done it since 2005. Trust me, I'm not making it up. It's awesome. And then the second thing that I want to suggest to you is, um, well, I can say two more things. When you have salad, this is a given, dressing on the side. So if you're ordering salad at a restaurant, do not let them put the salad dressing on the salad because they're going to put a ton of dressing. So ask for it on the side. That's that's a freebie. I wasn't even going to say that. Ketchup. So I made tater tots the other day for the kids. And normally I let them put a, like a pool of ketchup and they dip and they dive and then they end up doing like three or four tablespoons worth of ketchup per meal. And what I started doing is I started just putting, sprinkling enough ketchup on each tater top for them to eat and have the ketchup flavor on top of the of their of their starch. And in all in, it's about a tablespoon. They have enough ketchup on their tater tot slash french fries slash whatever it is that you're giving them. And they're not exceeding their caloric intake. This applies to you, it applies to your kids, it applies to whoever it is, by a condiment. Like, why do I want to add an extra 50, 60 calories, even 100 calories? My kids can go through eight tablespoons of ketchup in, in one seating. They are disgusting with ketchup. Think about how much waste that is. I don't, I don't want, I'd rather have a cookie. Give me a cookie if I'm going to have calories. I, I don't want it from ketchup. So if you're going to apply a condiment like ketchup or something like that that has extra calories, put it on and put it lightly and just put enough. Do not put it where you have to dip because if you are dipping, you are going to take much more than you need to take. So those are my two slash three because of the salad. Quick tips. I just want to put it out there. Think about it. Black tea, you're going, she's crazy, but you can't brown in black tea. You can. Start with the olive oil and with the black tea. Trust me, it works. And um, little by little, if you, do, if you do a lot of these little things, they all add up and that's what matters. And of course, exercise counts too, but these are just quick little tips to get you started. Okay.